We would go, we would rob stores at gunpoint. Bro, just rob the shit out of them. And we would all go in there and just rob them. Mm. Now, mind you now, this happened in 1980 and 81, so statute the statute has ran out. So don't y'all come after me with no damn questions later on. How much a part of your life was alcohol? A lot. A lot. A gang, I, the, the, a, a gang is gay. That's like gay. You know, I, I need help, but that's gay. That's a brave thing to say on television. You know, honest to God, right. they are. My dad died uh, from a heart attack with the assistance of my mom uh, when I was five. What does that mean? The assistance of your mom. Drove him crazy kind of thing, you mean? Or? No, actually, my family said that she poisoned him. To be truthful. You believe that? Yeah. Okay, so you have two kids? I probably got more. How many did you keep in touch with? My daughter. You gonna talk to your boy? No. What's the first crime young uh, Jerome commits? On robbery. That was it. You went right to there. You, I, there was no gateway crime. You, no. you didn't uh, steal a bazooka it candy was, it was, at it was, five. It was. I was sitting. I was at home. I was in the tenth grade. I was at home, and I had been like watching movies, and I'm like, I think I can do that. You don't really listen to gangster rap, do you? All this gangster shit aside, what do you listen to? Honestly, what do you put on at home? Sade. Were you close to your father? Yeah. Were you close to your mother? Never. Prior to that, never. I've never been, I've never liked her. I've never, I always used to tell her as a kid, I wish she would have been the one that died. Did you have your face covered? No! I was, I was an idiot, dude, I was stupid. <laughs> I was and like, you live in the neighborhood. And I stayed like, like, like the next apartment complex up the street. <laughs> and so, she handed me the money and looked at me like in disbelief. My father, I loved him to death, but he was an alcoholic and he was a violent alcoholic, you know what I mean? And uh, one time, uh, him and my mom got in an argument and she was leaving, right? She was leaving with me. And she went to put me in the car. And he ran out the back door with his gun, with his shotgun, and shot her in the back of the leg. If you had a chance to play the game a little bit, would you have? Nope. Even if I could tell you the story ends with you I don't know, main event in WrestleMania next year. That meant nothing. Uh, it, I, 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 could, I, I could make that same amount of money selling drugs if I wanted to. When they started throwing up gang signs, I didn't know what to do back. So I talked to a friend of mine that was, um, um, her son is deaf, deaf. And she would speak sign language. So she would show me sign language. So when I come on TV, I start doing sign language. And people thought I was throwing up gang signs. And <laughs> So I'm cutting the promo and I'm cutting the promo and I'm cutting the promo and I said I want to give a special shout out to my homeboy OJ Simpson. Keep up the good work. Two less to worry about. Mark Henry supposedly at one time being the strongest man in the world, but you know he wanted to play the game. He didn't knock Michael's head off. You know what I'm saying? So he allowed this guy to call him a nigger in front of the boys, and he didn't do shit because he wanted his job. Whereas me, I would have been fired. Was I doing coke the night I stabbed there? Yeah. The reason I did coke was because of something Eric said to me. And I was like, I want to be really pissed off when I do this. So let's go back for anyone that doesn't know. Uh, indie worker shows up, uh, gets a spot working for ECW that night. Uh, I, I don't know. I guess he had no experience in the ring prior. Gets put with you. How do you draw that short straw in life? Um, and comes up to you and says what in the locker room? Look, this is my, I'm from this town. My family's here. I know we gotta, I gotta do the job, but I got a couple of spots I wanna get in and I wanna get color, but I've never done it. Will you do it? I said, gladly. I said, no problem. I'll do it. What was the offense? The offense was telling you that you have to let him get. Yeah. Him, him telling, him even talking to me was the offense. What touches you emotionally? Trying to find a bunch of things. That is the... <laughs> wow. That was cheap. 
Oh, yeah. We, we went where I needed to go. That was shit. That is the weakness that I have. You got me. Oh, no. Touche. We know you a little too. <laughs> we know you a little too. <laughs>